Hi sellers, I believe there are a handful of new terms that you will need to learn and familiarize when you started to use Site Giant. And one of the most frequent terms that you heard and used are probably related to SKUs. This video is specially made for you to explain the differences and functions of these SKUs. In Site Giant, there are SKU, Parent SKU, ISKU, Parent ISKU, and Master SKU. And now, I will start to explain them to you. SKU and Parent SKU are marketplace based, which means they are set in Shopee, Lazada, TikTok, and so on. For example, I'm selling this sanitizer in Shopee. It has three variants and each variant has a unique SKU to identify them. This is the function of SKU. As these three variants are different variants under one product, you can then group them under parent SKU. Hence, you have one parent SKU and under this parent SKU, you have three SKUs. If you are still unsure of SKU and parent SKU, kindly replay this before proceeding to the next part. As we mentioned earlier, SKU and Parent SKU are mainly used in marketplaces such as Shopee, Lazada, TikTok, and so on. And now, ISKU, Parent ISKU, and Master SKU are only used in Site Giant. When you perform inventory linking for the very first time, the system will auto generate an inventory item in Site Giant to link to each of your product and variant in your product listing. All these inventory items have an unique identifier as well. They are called Inventory SKU, also known as ISKU. Parent ISKU is used to group multiple ISKU together. With Parent ISKU, you can tally inventory levels and update product pricing to all related channels across marketplaces easily. Lastly, we have Master SKU. This is a feature that is only available in Site Giant. As Parent SKU is used to group SKU and Parent ISKU is used to group ISKU, Master SKU is used to group Parent SKU together. Let's say we are selling this product with Parent SKU of A, B, C, 1, 2, 3. As we are selling the same product across multiple channels and marketplaces, and each of the channels have the same Parent SKU, you can group all these same products together using Master SKU and you will then be able to update product details and pricing for the product easily through our master SKU. Hope this video is able to bring you more clarity and understanding on the different terms of SKU inside Giant. Thank you and see you again in the next video.